this girl and her salt. Hashtag CF life. You were in the road. <laughs> Don't forget to laugh every day. <laughs> Good, Good morning. morning. You might think it's like five o'clock in the morning right now, but it's 5 p.m. <laughs> The sun sets at 421 and it's 506. So the moon is bright in the sky and we are ready to get out for the day. Yeah, we're gonna go I, out, do some shopping. Ollie's going hey, better Ollie. hurry somewhere. Ollie boy. He's trying to figure out if he can go pee while wearing this red backpack. We'll see <laughs> if he can do it. He maybe he did it in the background and you guys saw him. Come here, baby. He hasn't worn this backpack in a while, so Mary put it on <coughs> for this trip. It's the one that's like for oxygen tanks, but we use it as a backpack. Yeah. And if we ever need to use it as oxygen tanks, we have that backpack. So it's good to keep Ollie in it. What were you gonna say? Oh, I was just gonna update them. I did an hour of vest, saline. Did I do my palms on? She's like a CF rock star. Yeah. And Kasten, and I walked on the, or I did the elliptical already. So I've just been working all day. Yeah. And I'm really thankful I was able to do it again. I'm gonna really, really want to do it every day. I'm hoping it, it just gets truly, truly. It is so discouraging when I start walking and two minutes in, I start coughing so hard I'm gagging. Like I don't know whether to push myself and be like. Okay, gag, gag, gag. Okay, keep going. Or like, I don't know whether I should keep going or just be like, that's all I can do today. But it is really like discouraging when that's all I can do. So I think I figured out a way to breathe so that I'm not hard coughing through the elliptical. So today I was breathing kind of like you're blowing off your food that's too hot. Like, and I did that the entire 14 minutes. And the last 30 seconds, I could feel the mucus in my chest like rumbling. So I knew I was about to start coughing. And sure enough, I started coughing really hard, but I was able to keep going like while I was coughing and I finished my 14 minutes. So I was really Way happy. Way to go, Mary. Thanks. <laughs> here we go. All right, here we go. Hey guys, we just came to the mall to <coughs> walk around and- I'll sit. Let's sit while we Let's talk. Let's sit, all right. <laughs> so <laughs> I had to return something to Best Buy and Old Navy was next door and so <coughs> I went in Best Buy, Mary went in Old Navy and when I got done I went to Old Navy and <laughs> when I got done I went to Best Buy. So she calls me she's like where are you? I'm like I'm in Old Navy looking for you. She's like I'm in Best Buy looking for you. So anyways I went over to Best Buy and when I walked in the door. I had walked in like two minutes before. The workers were still talking about service dogs. When I, when I like walked by them at the entrance, I overheard them talking about service dogs. I was like, guess Mary's here. And what were they saying? They were just saying, I think they were talking about somebody, one of the workers was explaining to the other worker the difference between a therapy dog and a service dog. Good. Yeah. That's awesome. Yep. Cool. So anyways. There's that. Guys, if you watched the vlog from one year ago yesterday, you'll know we were in Glasgow in Scotland and we went to a mall and looked at all the Christmas decorations because remember we went to the Christmas market? Yeah, that was crazy. Anyways, check out the Christmas decorations. And look at this fountain. It's like flat and there's like a piece flat of gum. Glass. Yummy. Oh yeah. When you see gum on the streets, it's not free candy. What'd you get there? Pretzel. With butter she got an and Annie extra Ann's butter. pretzel with butter and extra butter. And I should have asked for extra salt, but oh well. I just have to lick them off the bottom and chew them up. This girl and her salt. Hashtag CF life. Mm. Hashtag she's licking the butter off the pretzel. The salt. The salt off the pretzel. And yeah, so. We're having fun. The mall is like mysteriously empty, so it's really nice. So nice. What are you doing? We're in a toy store. It's so fun. Okay, you hold it. Hold it like this. Okay. Yeah. That is so cool. That is cool. 
This is therapeutic. Or psychedelic. I think I'm high. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Sneaky high. Ah, it's like a fan. All right, guys, so Mary really wanted to come in anthropology because they got good stuff, but she's a little weary. <laughs> she's like, I need to sit down. So we're sitting here at this little table. They got these cute little mugs, cute little plates, cute little wife, cute little service stall. You right there, honey? Yeah. Okay, guys, now we're in the next store. Mary, I, let me just say, I'm so proud of Mary. She worked out this afternoon, and we've been walking in the mall for a long time, over a mile, at least. And now she's, we're in a kitchen store, and she's sitting on the floor looking at little utensils. Tiny little spoons. And let me just say, I really like these copper silverware right here. I think that's really classy. I agree with him. Too bad they cost like an arm and a leg and your soul. Yeah. <laughs> Say hi. Hi. <laughs> Alright guys, so sometimes when Mary's worn out, I'll just come into the grocery store and we will FaceTime. But sometimes Mary it says embarrassing things while she's on FaceTime just to make me embarrassed. So coming through. Little whipper snapper. Oh. oh, it's so dark. Oh my goodness, they were headbutting. We just pulled in. And these deer were basically where our car is now. But they ran. This must be their favorite place. And there's a third one to the left, but I don't think you'll be able to see it. They were like kissing each other. They were headbutting. Or something like that. They're cute. Let's name them. Okay. Fonley and Bromley. Fonley and Bromley. <laughs> okay, Fonley and Bromley. Fonley and Bromley. And that third one doesn't get a name because he's too far away. <laughs> he's too far away. They're so cute. They are pretty cute. Delicious dinner time. Or wait, what what meal is this? I don't even know. I don't know. I guess either. it is dinner. Wait, it. What's that? Is that your foot? Yeah. Oh, are you okay? Unless you had, was your pretzel your dinner? I don't know. Well, we're having burrata and... Salad. Salad and tomatoes. And balsamic on it. Mm. And grape juice. Yeah. We really like this brand of grape juice. <laughs> Did you show them the brand there? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Kadem. Kadem. All right. Here we go. And now we're eating. Trader Joe's. Orange chicken, Mary's personal favorite. Yay! And brown rice is in the microwave. And there's our favorite grape juice. And there's an elderly man on our screen. <laughs> <laughs> okay, there's the rice. Now it's time to eat. I just love this orange chicken. You like put olive oil in the pan and fry it in the pan first, right? Yeah. And then add the little sauce packet and Voila. Voila. And it's like four something for the whole package. And it feeds Cheap. one meal, two meal, plus leftovers, so three meals. So it's pretty good. Better, it's cheaper than buying Chinese food. Plus, it's um, better on the tummy. And something, an easy meal that you like that's good calories. Yeah, like, that's true. That's worth, I mean, if it was $10, we'd probably <laughs> still buy it. Um... Yeah, calories, they need to get in me. I'm just not, I don't really have the hunger for a lot of calories, but I did eat that cheese over there. It's Parmesan and Gouda. Which was my bad. <laughs> Mary wanted Parmesan and I grabbed that just seeing the first word. <laughs> oh well, it was good, thank you. You're welcome. I was tuckered out from all that working tonight. We went all over the mall and he worked hard. Thanks for your work, buddy. And yeah, Mary. Yeah, forward momentum. Helpful. That was my knees. Poor Peter's knees. Poor um, knees. I'm filling up my cobblers. 
um, because... These are cobblers if you're new around here. Oh yeah, pill organizers, which <laughs> we call cobblers. Um, which kind of just came out of nowhere one day. I was sitting at the table with my sister and brother-in-law. And I was like, can you hand me my cobbler? It just came out. So anyway, <laughs> it shall now be known as cobbler. Anyway, I'm filling them up and I just take this... In my medicine drawer, I have a few of these clear bins from the Dollar Tree. And I just keep my pills in there and... I keep like backup pills in this one, weekly pills in this one. So this is my like weekly pill fill up thingy. And then here's a little tip. I'm not sure if this is like legal, <laughs> but I, so I took an empty bottle. This was a little pill bottle for, from Scotland actually. And it's like the cutest, tiniest little thing. And my vitamin K pills are really small, so I don't need a giant bottle. Like, it comes in a bottle this size. So I took the label off of the bottle it came in, so I know the exact um, expiration. expiration date. And I put it on the little bottle, and then each time I refill it, um, I put the new sticker on top. So there's a little tip, so that they all fit in perfectly. Because I'm like, I just want my weekly ones to fit in there like this. So anyway, I just, um, that's what I do. And then for, like, my calcium bottle, this bottle is old, but I t get a big new bottle and fill up the little bottle. There's a, that was, like, bottle count 2015. Like, how many times did I say bottle? So I took an empty bottle. This was a little pill bottle for, from Scotland, actually. And it's, like, the cutest, tiniest little thing. And my vitamin K pills are really small, so I don't need a giant bottle. Like, it comes in a bottle this size. So I took the label off of the bottle it came in, so I know the exact um, expiration expiration date. And I put it on the little bottle, and then each time I refill it, um, I put the new sticker on top. That's what I do. And then for like my calcium bottle, this bottle is old, but I t get a big new bottle and fill up the little bottle. So anyway, um, that's how I do it. And usually I don't come on the bed, but I was already kind of like tuckered down for the night. Um, tuckered down. And that's another word apparently. I just made that <laughs> And if you guys <laughs> didn't see our video that we did where we showed you Pill Pack, um, it's a mail order pharmacy that packages your pills and in kind of like each of your doses. Um, I'll put a link to that video down below. Um, it's a really cool company. Fortunately, our insurance isn't compatible with it yet. So. I can't um, wait till it is. I'm so excited. Anyways, that was our cobbler talk for the evening, and we're going to get to bed. We will see, see you, you tomorrow. tomorrow. Good, Good night, night, Brady and Broccoli. Yeah. That's how we do it here in Scotland. Broccoli's in the oven and it's hot.